june eighteenth st marcus and marcellianus martyrs interest in these saints has been revived in modern times by the discovery in part of the catacomb of st balbina which bears their name of the tombs of the two martyrs over which is mounted a fresco representing the martyrdom of them and their companions these saints were brothers deacons of the roman church who perished early in the reign of diocletian these saints were twins of high birth who had been converted to christianity in their youth and they had each married in the persecution which broke out soon after diocletian's ascension they were cast into prison and were condemned to be beheaded their friends obtained for them a thirty-day respite in the hope of being able during that time to persuade them to offer the required sacrifices and they were removed to the house of the public registrar there their wives their little children their heathen parents each sought by tears and entreaties to shake their constancy but saint sebastian then an officer in the emperor's household visited them daily and encouraged them to preserve the outcome of the various interviews and discussions which took place was the conversion of the martyrs relations and also of the public registrar and shortly afterwards of chromatius who set the prisoners free resigned his post as judge and retired into the country although marcus and marcellianus were concealed by a christian official of the imperial household they were betrayed by a renegade and recaptured fabian who had succeeded chromatius condemned them to be bound to two wooden pillars to which their feet were then nailed when they had been thus exposed for twenty-four hours they were then pierced by lances the relics were translated from the catacombs to the church of saints cosmas and damian and are now in the basilica of saint praxedes in rome we know not what we are till we have been tried it costs nothing to say we love god above all things and to show the courage of martyrs at a distance from the danger but that love is sincere which has stood the proof persecution shows who is a hireling and who a true pastor says st bernard 